What's going on everyone? Welcome back into some Anno 1800. Okay, so Orizalva looks a little, just a little bit different since the last time you saw it. Uh, if you have seen my post on YouTube or the announcement on the Discord, I was having some major DirectX issues. Hopefully they're resolved. I've been playing uh, another game. I started a new game in Anno here just to test and mess around for a little while. And I played for about an hour with no problems. So I felt comfortable loading up our main save right here and hope. Hopefully it's all working. I'm, I'm crossing my fingers. So, uh, what I was trying, kept trying to work on every time I was starting it, it was I want to, uh, I want to work on a few things in the new world here. As I mentioned in the last episode, I want to start doing a little demodification of the of the series here. Of course, we're not going to get rid of every mod because there's a lot of mods I like. We had a big discussion on that on Discord actually earlier today. I enjoy putting in, you know, ornament mods. I really like my ornament mods. They, uh, you know, I could do fun little things like these. Now, we are getting some walls and fences with Bright Harvest, uh, but I don't know what those are going to look like, and we will most certainly be putting those in, in the game as well. But there are some ornament mods I want to keep and mess around with, so I'm going to keep and mess around with those. However, I am getting rid of several things. Uh, although you may not notice it if unless you're just like a hawk with Hawkeyes staring at my menus, you'll notice that there are several tabs that are missing now. A um, good way to go is to go under the sort by building type and go under culture. Quite a few of our options are now missing. Uh, basically all that's left in terms of mod stuff are the noms, the nom parks, the nom ornaments, and the forests. I love these because I like having the uh, option to have my trees and different park stuff with none of the uh, dark green tile underneath it and then we have the fences as well uh, uh let's see was there anything else there's really nothing else i pretty much got rid of all of the other city ornaments and all of that other stuff i got rid of a whole whole lot of ornaments uh from the game you know it's actually kind of odd it doesn't sort any of those it looks like here that's fine. Uh, of course, I did not get rid of our land ornaments or our port ornaments. And we kept like some of the... I, lo I love warehouses. I love, love, love warehouses. So warehouses of all types are staying. I'm keeping all that, which um, a lot of that is part of the harbor life, which of course we're not using this harbor life category for building stuff on the water. But I do enjoy parts of Harbor Life, some of the items it comes with, like the lighthouses and some of the uh, options for the keys uh, and things like that. So we're going to keep some of that stuff like that. But for the most part, we have gotten rid of, I got rid of about 10 mods yesterday, which might have contributed to all the crashing. I don't know. But uh, anyways, so going from those, the next thing I have to consider is what gameplay mods would I like to remove? Um people are still actually voting oddly enough on the uh which mod would you like to see removed and right now the two that everyone's talking about the most removed wanting removed are the free farm field placement which was one that technically won after i stopped looking at the, the uh votes on it by the way stop voting on that stop voting on it i'm not gonna look at it anymore quit voting quit voting the voting is over it has ended it is done um Free farm field placement, I am going to take that mod out and we are going to deal with that when Bright Harvest releases because we're going to have to rearrange quite a bit of our farmland anyways, so we will deal with that mod at that time. Uh, the other two were the New World the New World Commuter Pier, which we have here, and then of course the increased radius for everything. Um, I've been kind of tossing a bit back and forth on that, and I have decided that I am going to get rid of the New World Commuter Pier. I am going to keep the Radius Increase mod, uh, simply for the fact that I... This right here is three times larger than the default. The default one is like right here, basically. It's right there. It's just, it's too small. It makes me claustrophobic. I can't stand it. I like to space things out. Um, 
and I just I can't stand having having to build it all right in this itty bitty circle I think it looks ugly I think it looks bad I like it to look like this you know I mean so I can space all of my buildings out having to have all of my coffee factories basically in like this it just it just looks bad it it does not go with the building style that I do so I am not going to get rid of it but we are going to get rid of the new world commuter piers uh, I think that would be a good you know just a good compromise basically let's see what he's got for us real quick puzzle quest to find some crocodiles okay we'll find crocodiles while I chat so yeah, New World Commuter Pier is going to go. Uh, I think it would be kind of fun just to deal with... You know, it's not a mechanic that is going to hurt my gameplay or hurt my city building style. If anything, it might promote it because I'll need to build more nice looking cities all over the place. Which there's never anything wrong with building more cities. Where is this last crocodile? Oh wait, no, that's four. So in order to get rid of the New World Commuter Piers, we're going to have to go to our different islands and ensure that we have proper workforce on each one to cover everything we need. And uh, we got a Perry's Giant Sunburst. Okay, cool. So looking at our workforce here, I've already started doing uh, quite a bit of this at the moment. Uh, we're going to need more abreros. We're going to need quite a bit more ornaleros. So we're going to need a large population over here to support all of this industry, which means, of course, we're going to be needing to bring in uh, more goods and all of that. So that is going to be the focus of today's episode. We're going to expand Orizalva, make it a nice big city, and get all of our workforce we need over here so we can remove the uh, commuter piers right here. So let's just go ahead and get... Of course, I'm not going to remove it until we have it fixed. I've got to fix my problem before I remove the commuter pier, or it's just going to be a disaster. But I can monitor it right here by looking at my workforce. And once the commuter number is at zero, then I can remove the commuter pier because then we'll basically have an island that is set up like it should have been from the beginning. So enough yapping from me. Let's make that happen. I'm gonna put him. Eh, you know what? No, no, no. I'm gonna put him right there. Okay. So I do want to upgrade some more of these guys. And I already started building some stuff over here. Let's see how it's do. Oh, wait a minute. I do want to turn off rum. They don't get rum. Uh, coffee. Okay. And cigars. So that gets turned off. And coffee gets turned off. Yeah. They're not getting coffee. They're not getting rum. They're not getting either of those two items right here. We do need more ponchos now, so let's go ahead and get another poncho darner put in, which he can fit lovingly right there. Seductive charts bury my desk. All right, we'll put him right there. I'm just gonna take that one out then. Okay, so there is more ponchos for the people. Uh, I also had a sh or maybe I didn't. Hold on. I might not have yet. Yeah, no, I kept. Cra I've crashed so many times. I can't remember what I was doing, what I wasn't. Okay, let's bring. I was filling this thing right here up with items that need to come down. So we've got Dr. Ali Al Zahir, which does New World crop farms, productivity, and produces some goodies. And then the uh, cough, the uh, poncho darner and bombin weaver that makes the extra work clothes and fur coats. That's going to be good because I can send that back up here to Cape Trelawney. Wanted to grab a couple of those two electrical bells right there for reduced workforce because that's going to help us a lot. And I wanted to grab the patent C drill. And I believe I had one more, Go Gordon the Master Grocer. So let's send that on to the New World. 
Now I'm being paranoid because this is typically where I crash. So let's just save before I screw all this up. Okay, good deal. All right, so that is all in. Game save. The next thing we are going to need is they need uh, tortillas, which I already have uh, put together the, yeah, I put there over here. I've already got the cattle farms over there for the uh, tortillas. Although, do I have another? I have a Gordon right there, trade union, here we go. Where, where's one of my, oh right, I was, Bringing some wood up to there. And let's bring some wood over to here. And then I have built ourselves a brigantine right here. Let's bring him over there to pick up some stuff. Have him pick up some more items. Which items do we have over here? We have another one of those. Instead of the corn, the building process is plantains, and it produces extra. Actually, that would be a good one to put in. We'll do that, and we'll bring in plantains instead of corn. That would not be a bad one. We'll see what else we can bring over. Okay, so we'll get a few items there. So that just means we're going to need more bananas let's see where are we going to uh, put in the bananas oh wait that's corn that's not bananas wait it can have bananas there but I really need another island I need an island Benta hi I need, I need this. Must be you want to finance them. Thank you. I, I need your I need this island. I need the bananas from it. Um, I can just come over here and get some more bananas too. The bananas are a uh, smaller, simpler item to produce. I do need to check here. Uh, are we getting any commuter? No, they're sending out the commuter. Okay. So this island is actually okay in terms of workforce. We've got a plenty. I hope this is enough room to get another one. It is not, unfortunately. Okay. Uh, you know what? I can do this. Let's just take him out. get him filled in first since he is kind of the uh, linchpin of it fill him in okay and then I can fill him in and this is all still normal with the game I, it's not being anything weird so it should be okay there we go so plenty of bananas now Pretty sure I have a banana route, don't I? Yes, I I have our uh, we have our silly little airship right here. Um, you know, I'll just leave him for the time being. It's fine. He was picking up rum and dropping rum off at Las Bernaderas. Really? Why? 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 Why was I doing that? Because it's getting... All the rum is going to there. Why did I do that? He's taking rum from there to up there? 
What what's the deal with my run my run routes here? I mean like real talk, what's happening? Good job. So I have run oh I have run for them. That's what it was. Okay. So you know what? I'm gonna do this. Um Uh, let's delete that route. As you can see right here, I actually have deleted the uh, deleted that airship thing. I I'm not really I wasn't loving it honestly. I mean it was cool, but I don't know. I just I wasn't Wait loving this forward. thing. All right, let's see. We can. I'm just gonna keep trying to unload some stuff. I may keep that little airship just for fun, but I don't think I'm gonna build any more of them. Okay, let's grab this tortilla maker guy. Um, I'm not gonna grab him just yet. We'll wait on that. We'll grab one of him just in case. Let's grab one of those. Coffee is not gonna be produced over there, so it's fine. These are all kind of meh. Um, let's grab another one of her just in case as well. New orders, Admiral. Okay, we'll bring him down to drop off those items. This battle cruiser is kind of my little guardian right here. Okay. All right, let's crank things up for a moment. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to unload these items and then I'm going to set this brigantine to start bringing bananas uh, back and forth. Bring some bananas down and then bring a little bit of uh, rum back up to help supply rum to uh, Las Bernanderas. We're up to our eyebrows. Yeah. We're up to our eyebrows in coffee. Okay, so there's all of that. Let's get a trade route going from here to there. Eh, let's flip it around. That way I don't get myself confused. All right. Let's pick up several things of bananas. And we'll unload that. And we will load up some rum and drop it off. And we'll stop it at that right there for the moment. Okay. So he's going to go back up there and grab the bananas. Now, unfortunately, this is full, so I am going to have to actually move this to another location. I don't want to put it over there for reasons you will see very soon. So actually, we just we're just going to have to have another trade union, which is fine. Uh, let's see, we'll put a trade union in right here. There must be in and the tortilla maker. I can teach you how it works. Plus 50% needs bananas and beef. Your ship has returned from its voyage. Actually, I bet. Let me do this. Put him way out here. Alright, animal farms. Farms, which I need seriously a better layout for. I, I really actually hate the beef, but I don't have a better layout for it at the moment. Okay, and there is the. There's those guys. I heard it say ship has entered the region. There you are. Uh, how are you doing? Okay, let's unload some stuff over here. Hang out for just a few and we already have a town hall right there so that's good we can equip him with a Gordon the master grocer for beer consumption 
Well, once we unlock the need for beer consumption, I guess, basically. All right, let's take a look. Let's see how this is doing now. Tortillas is good. We're doing okay on beef. Uh, I'm, I'm assuming we're gonna be fine on the bananas. Yeah. So now we just need... How are we doing? Still need quite a few more people. So we're actually gonna start expanding over into uh, this section right here. something like that ah no not like that like like that you know what fine just do that then I don't even care just do that that's fine or don't okay there there we go that's what I'm looking for exactly going to fit anything very well but that's okay we might not even need it let's get ourselves one of those in get another police station in just because we are we do have working conditions set a little bit higher so they're probably going to be upset about it give them some church Now we have an island balance of 136. We still do need some more of these we guys. Your We're in the presence of a virtuoso. That's fine. I'll deal with him in just a moment. Crown Falls, what you giving me? Uh, another champagne lady. Okay, I'll take her. You reached a new milestone. Oh, and I just forgot, we also completed this. I, we got, yeah, I was trying to get some fountain decor. Yep. Okay, we've got eight of the channels, and we got eight of the fountains, and we have 16 channels. Okay, good. That's what I was wanting. Let's get back to the new world now. Now to smuggle it out. All right, almost have enough. All right, now we need bombins. Uh, let me see here, bombins. Yes. Okay. Bombin weaver. Um, you know what? Let's put that Bombin Weaver up here, actually. Yeah, I'm going to put him right here, because I do have... See, that's the Patent Seed Drill. We don't need that there. Yeah, Poncho Darner and a Bombin Weaver. Let's do that. Where's my poncho darners? I have two. I have one here that we could move. I have one right here that we can move. Okay. It's going to give me fur coats and work clothes and a plus 50%. Is that going to be too many ponchos though? I think it is actually. What if we, uh, what if we take one out? Okay, yeah. No, never mind. Never mind. I take it back. I take it back. I take it back. We gotta have it. We've got to have it. Okay. Choo, 
back in then. Okay, now. So that takes care of that. I just want to see what other things we brought down. The New World Crop Farms. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Now let me take a look right here. We've got that that makes the coffee. Got that. Hmm. I really, really, really need a three-slot trade union down here. I can definitely definitely need that uh, we're going to slot one of these in over here to reduce the workforce down quite a substantial amount all right now we actually have a balance yep now we actually have a balance okay good that is what we're looking for it's really wanting to put it over here though because we have well the rum distilleries only do a little bit of Arnolero workforce it's not a lot these guys actually took up quite a bit more with the ch from the chocolate fa oh that chocolate factory is out of range actually I never even noticed that let's get him back in range here there we go okay yeah that does save me on Obreros. What have we got up here in this trade union? Quite a few things, actually. Uh, produces extra cocoa. Okay. Yes, yeah, so I'm kind of just looking around at my trade union, seeing where I can improve things. Thinking I might do a trade union sp uh, specifically for animal farms, maybe. I don't know. Let's see. Where is alpaca? Okay, so alpaca wool. We do need. We either need another one, or we need to move the alpaca farms up here within range of this trade union, since I do have that item up there that is increasing how much they get which that might actually be a, uh, a better solution okay and I have one more right here oh I think he's already no he's not in range and if you hear a, a dog barking outside apologies is one of our dogs who probably sees a squirrel and is having a complete and total heart attack at the moment because there's a squirrel and you know dogs and squirrels jeez okay alpaca wool is good now uh, we're producing cotton huh we're producing cotton oddly enough okay <laughs> sure let's put in a cotton mill then Dog is about to go get yelled at, though. Alright, what did that do? Need me two, so I need one more cotton plant, cotton mill somewhere. Um, this looks like a good place for one. Okay. Have enough cotton. Yeah, probably could do with one cotton plantation. Just need one, really, it looks like. This looks like a nice little uh, spot for a cotton plantation. And are you in range of that? You're in range of that. Okay, so there is some cotton. We have, uh, oh, that's right, we need felt for the uh, bombins. So we do need a felt producer. Let's 
have him go to there. Okay, there. Felt producer. How many of these are we going to need, though? One more. Um, yeah, I'm just kind of, you know, trying to find rather, you know, somewhat interesting places to put them. Okay, so there's felt. Uh, we just need more alpaca wool again. No, I, I love my dogs to death. Don't get me wrong, but sometimes I'm just, I just want to throw a shoe at them and tell them to shut up. It's like, just shut up, just shut up. It's okay. It's just a squirrel. It's just a squirrel. I promise it is not going to hurt you. Just, just hush, just hush. Okay, how are we doing? I think we're good. I think we're good. Okay, let's save real quick, just in case something weird happens with it. And let's delete. Got us back 15 influence. We're still okay there. Yeah, everybody's good. Everybody's happy. Everybody's happy. Yes. All right. Uh, just one moment, guys. I'm going to pause the recording just for a second. Okay. And I am back. Sorry about that. I had to go have a uh, little, little Still chat with my dog and tell her to uh, bless her heart. I, I love her to death. She is a she's a sweet little thing. She only has one eye. She she was a stray that we took in, and she she had lost an eye in a and what we assume is like a just a, a battle royale with some other animal. <laughs> bless her heart. She's such a sweet little thing. But she does love to bark at the squirrels, so, you know, I had to tell her, you know, hey, I'm kind of busy, can't be can't be having all that barking right now. So anyways, yeah, first island without a commuter pier fixed, and I think it's all, it's all done, it's fixed here. It's not pretty looking at the moment, we've got a lot of, uh, we got a lot of work to make it look pretty. But they are at least satisfied. They'll have bombins coming in here pretty soon. They have all of these needs. Or somehow they have beer. Oh, I was like, how do you have beer? Um, duh, they have beer because of that. I was like, how do you have beer? Right. Yeah, they don't have beer, but it's okay. They're still fairly happy on this island. All right. Can we empty any of this? Yeah, we, looks like we took that. So I mean, I'm not going to get rid of just a schooner, but we are going to not really use those much. They they're fairly weak in terms of their supply ability, but it's it is kind of fun to have. So we will we'll leave just a schooner over here. Oh, I see a quest over here at Isabella's place. These people. Uh, an escort quest. Uh, you know what? Why not? I'll do that. Grab a couple of uh, battle cruisers to go help that. So the next one that I need to prepare for then, or actually is the only other one right now that we have a, new, a commuter pier out, is over here. Um, okay, come on, come on, come on. Get over there. drop that off so this is the other island that we're going to have to get get that going uh Ortoleros is fine however it's the obreros that i am having a concern with Ready for a challenge. so what i am actually going to do is we're going to grab some of this and some of this i'll go check that in just a moment and we're going to grab another one of our oxford bells um, let's see, corn, caoutchouc, let's grab our patent seed drill, and we're going to take all of that up here, we're going to bring him down to here, are our battle cruisers here yet? Uh, one of them is, oh there he comes, okay, let's wait for our other battle cruiser to come down first. So yeah, we're going to send 
all of this up, but we're going to set up, up a, another trade union right here to get these right here on and see if we can't reduce that down to where we don't need the commuter. We might not need to build anything at all up here for the time being, if I can get these coffee roasters down a little bit lower on the workforce requirement. Okay, that's good enough. All right, let's get a little closer, trigger the quest. Yes, escort away. I'm by right anyway. Where is that slow, stupid ship? There he is. You can rely on us. Get our frigates kind of out here, protecting the harbor. Got to watch. You having trouble getting alpaca wool? It's just very, very slow, apparently. Let's upgrade him. So we do have some in storage. Okay. Okay, that seems okay now. Alright, he is here. Let's drop off these goodies. Let's get ourselves another trade union built. Um, I think right here... We oh, hey, look at that. That thing's been destroyed. Whoops. Who knows how long that's been sitting there. Okay. That. Patent seed drill. Uh, coffee roaster. Actually, no, let's not do the coffee roaster just yet. Let's do that. What did that take me down to? I only needed plus 25 now. Okay. Need 225? Uh, 90? Okay, where's the rest of it coming from? Oh, is it this right here? Hold on. Calculator. I can't do math in my head. Okay, so that right there is taking 45 obreros. Each of these is taking 90. So yeah, this, that's where it's coming from. It's the two coffee roasters. Um... I don't have to have it there. Your ship has returned from its voyage. Yeah, I don't have to have it there. That's all it's doing right there is him. It's picking up coffee from there. So instead, we could pick up coffee from here. Your people are rioting. Uh oh. Uh oh, over here in Escoping. I. I know why they're rioting too. Because they don't have a. It's because they don't have a market. <laughs> they're not happy without a market. Let's uh. Let's just do a little temp work to fix that. There we go. <laughs> Fixed. Okay, back to the new world then. Is he doing okay? Oh yeah, he's doing fine. Just fine. Okay. So what we do is we can do that. We will take coffee roasters out for now I will leave this right here in there I think if I take that out island balance is yeah actually let's just do it that way just load up all of the coffee that was on this island and we'll just bring it all back down to here um Uh, oh, it's just a the monitor attacking. It's fine. Okay, so island balance, island balance. Let's destroy that one. You look idle. Do this, would you? Uh, delivery quest. Where where you want me to do this quest at? In the old world. Don't keep me waiting. Twenty brass. Do I even have twenty brass over here? I might. Whoops, that's not it. That's an easy quest. Sure, I'll give you 20 brass. Von Malkin. Yeah, there you go. Okay, easy. Easy quest. Okay, Escoping is all taken care of now. What I might do is actually just move these. Uh, I can't move it to there. 
put him right here. That way he covers all of these uh, corn, these corn farms. So that island is all taken care of. This island is all taken care of. So we can now destroy the commuter pier Where over there. And there we go. Commuter piers are all removed in the new world. We are back to default gameplay in this area. Feels good, man. Feels good to be back to normal. And I'm happy with that. I think it'll be I think it'll be pretty good. Oh, we still have this guy. A shipbuilder. No, thank you. Alright. Got us back quite a bit of influence. Not having to do the uh, commuter piers and stuff. Yeah, so now we're only spending 75 on computer peers. That's mostly all over in the uh, Old World and Cape Trelawney. So those are good to go now. And all of our islands have, you know, at least a small workforce balance as we need to expand. Yes, I will do that with you. All right, let's take a look at all productions here. See where we stand on everything. Rum is actually getting a little iffy getting a little iffy on the rum situation uh yeah don't care about all that arctic crap We've been singing and we do have it turned off for all of them it's we're just we're just having a rum problem in general uh be sure where you continue buying up her island because I want Kindermind right here for myself. We also need to keep an eye on her. her uh, Very little to amend. Extremely generous uh, Let's offer a gift. Act of well, let's ingratiate ourselves to her because we are going to make her very mad when we uh, we take that island from her. But hey, I gotta have it. Gots to have it. These guys up here, uh, let's just turn rum off to them. And let's just stop with the rum on that one. Where is that ship? It's right there. Uh, here we go. Ooh, there's actually a bunch of stuff extra being produced over here. that too how are they producing so much extra stuff how are they producing so much extra do I have them full, boss. no okay how do you have oh, I guess we just have extra that's fine okay that's fine we'll just take some of that um, where is that ship at let's just dump that overboard that's fine so they really don't need rum uh, those guys aren't getting rum. Getting a plus forty percent happiness. Okay, you know what? We can just turn off rum for them as well. We will be so much stronger today. No, I don't want an alliance. And then I can take. Where was that? Where was that one route that was doing? Without Wait, you, fish. I don't know what we would have done. No. Fish, rum. That was odd. Oh wait, no, no, no. Yeah, rum. That was weird. Yeah, rum. We can just take that route off completely. Uh, actually, no. We do want to load up the rum from here and take it over there. Yes, that's what I want to do. Yeah. I have to find that ship and make sure he's not all okay. He's at Orizalva, but he didn't pick any up, so we'll tell him to pick some rum up. I probably need to get another cargo ship for this line. That way, I'm bringing back plenty of it all. Hi. So, yeah, now he's just going from there to there. So, that's good. Okay. Good deal. That one's fixed. So do I even need rum on this island anymore? I don't think I do. I think I've I think I've just stopped rum completely. Yeah. Let's just start loading up. Well, let's, let's 
just start loading up all the rum. And we'll go take a bunch of it down. And I'll go do it with him. We'll just transport some more rum over here just to make sure that there's plenty in stock. Uh, I'm going to cancel anything with that one. Those are all fine. That's all fine. I think everything is looking okay now. Rum is turned off to them. Rum is turned... I just don't want rum to anybody in the new world. Let's just stay at that. No rum to any of these people. Because I can just do this every time. And it's fine. It's all fine and dandy. Yeah, shut up. I don't care. It's the same with coffee. You know, I don't want anyone to have coffee in the new world. Because I need coffee for the old world. These guys are just going to have to deal with it. Awaking new horizons. Just be sure I'm not transporting any more rum anywhere. Uh, I actually, I was. Is there anything else from Lost Bird and Darius I need to bring over? Possibly cigars. Possibly the cigars. We'll just leave it at that for the moment then. And go drop off. Okay, so he's full up on the rum actually at the moment. That's my chocolate ship. So he's going to Orizalva to go pick some up. We'll tell it to pick the chocolate up from here. Get more from there. That'll be good. That's fine. That one's fine. That's that chocolate route we just looked at. Yeah, I was making sure that I wasn't transporting rum anywhere else that it didn't need to be. That is all going to Crown Falls. That is going to North Happing. That's bringing double rum and double chocolate. Okay. I forgot about that route. This is bringing rum... But I don't think I need it to bring rum. Let's have it not do that then. Let's actually have it stop over at this island. We're in the presence of a virtuoso. And pick up some fur coats and drop those off. That crown falls again. Uh, window dresser. Okay. Alright, coffee, coffee, coffee. Yeah, am I angry? Do I have something that's actually making me rum over here? Or no? Yeah, I don't. Okay. For some, I, I mean, I didn't think I did, but if there was something that was producing rum as, an, as a byproduct, like we have chocolate as a byproduct right here, from the coffee roaster. If we had something with that from Lost Baron Dares for rum, it would show up, but we don't. So that is all fine and good. Only thing we are producing here though, is we are getting coffee. Yeah, coffee is coming from the coffee roasters on Lost Baron and Dares. Okay, that's good. Okay, I think it's all, I think I'm all, I think I'm all fixed. So all of this right here, basically, now that we've turned all of that off, our rum goes down barely. It just barely goes down. Jeez, so much rum. But everyone's still fairly happy, even without the rum, and, I don't, and I'm okay with it. Like, even they're happy, even though they don't get rum. Okay, I think we're good. And we have a quest, a puzzle quest. Oh, we have to go find. We have to go find the bear and the boy. There they are. What'd you give me? What'd you give me? What'd you give me? Stop! I want to know what I got. Quartz crystal crap. Okay, expeditions. Let's check this guy out. Minefield. Let's try to search through the papers. We got a reward of a torpedo that I don't need. Continue 
on. I really need this mission to end before it fails. Ah, really need it to end before it fails. Okay. I believe everybody is happy. Well, that wasn't as bad as I thought it would. I honestly thought it was going to be a lot worse to get rid of the uh, commuter peers here in the new world. Um, just, you know, to be honest with you, I thought it was going to be a whole lot worse of an ordeal to get rid of those. But it wasn't as nearly as bad as I thought it would be. So I'm very happy about that. Let's just double check all of our stuff here and make sure we're producing everything we need. Everything looks nice and well balanced. Oh, you know, wood, but wood is being made over here on this island with the help of our saws and everything. Everything else looks rather tasty, and I think we are good to go. So that basically leaves the only gameplay mods that are actively using are the uh, increased radius mods for item buildings and oil refineries and gas pumps. Um, the oil refiners and gas pumps, that, that's another one. I'm going to have to kind of sit off camera and take a look at those and see what it's going to take to make those more baseline and make those, uh, you know, just fit the base game mechanics more. Um, you know, my eventual goal, if I, if I can make it all work right, really is I wouldn't mind going to a default game with just ornamental mods just so I can make the game, the cities look prettier. Um, I feel like I was challenged the other day by some people to make, you know, that I can make a really nice looking city without having all of these gameplay mods, and which is true. I can do that. I don't have any, I know it's within my ability and my, you know, realm of creativity to cr to make a city look really good without gameplay mods ornamental mods yes that's i can though i can do that with without those but you know they're ornamental mods well, who doesn't love ornaments but the gameplay mods yeah i could probably do without them so you know we may spend some time restructuring our oil refineries and gas pumps and try to get those all right? set up a little different it's just little things we're going to have to work on um you know hold on just Dump that overboard and go pick that up. Because I don't need him getting the rum anymore. I just want him with that. So things I need to work on a little bit is I need to get uh, items in some of our new ships and everything taken care of. And get all those kitted out so they can travel around a little bit faster. Uh, maybe get some new cargo ships on a couple of routes that we have going. And then prepare for the next episode and keep preparing for Bright Harvest here pretty soon. I can't wait. So with that, guys, thank you so much for joining me, and we will see you in the next one.